Hey there everyone, this is Mystic Fish and welcome to episode 47 of our Factorio series where we're building an expandable base. The base is proceeding uh, to take shape here, which is good stuff. Last episode we got all of the inputs connected to science and so we are now sciencing properly. Uh, we can see that uh, so far we've got the belts showing up in the right way as uh, the filters are uh, spitting them out for the sushi belt. So that is good stuff. Um, labs are going, are going full speed ahead, or well, you know, several of them are. So that's good. Uh, what else? Okay, so I think we said that the next thing that we want to do is um, we are going to work on expanding the rail network out over here in some fashion that allows us to connect the rails across this way and uh, and probably down here to connect with, uh, that doesn't get us all the way. I really wanna connect this all the way through. Oh, I can rotate this. I can rotate this T-junction and then we'll get the rails across here uh, what else did we do? Last episode, we also got, where is it? Um, okay, these things have all stopped making landfill, which means that mm, all the landfill we're looking for should be on its way here. Although it looks like we're missing a roboport to finish that. But, um, okay, what else have we got? This one. I mean, let's just get all the stuff. Uh, we're, although we're gonna quickly run out of research we can do, but I guess that's okay. Uh, we need to work on getting blue science up and running, which uh, it occurs to me that uh, we're going to need another, another iron smelting for this. And it seems like we're not gonna be doing the module build until later. I wanna get all the sciences stood up before we ever even build any modules. And we've already used the copper for the modules anyway. So I think what I wanna do is actually use this smelting here for blue science so we can route it into here. And then we'll get another copper outpost down here that we can route across and plug in. We've already got the coal that it needs for plastic and so on. So that'll mean that we can, uh, we do have to figure out how to expand copper. So we will have to do this rail stuff. Um, I am, one of the things that I think I do want to show is um, that, let's see, let's get our straight wall of mines. Um, we can put those there. Um, these mines are not lined up right. We can't have that. Um, but, oh, sorry, let's get a map view. Uh, I do think what we want to do is, where are we missing? I just took these out. Okay, defenses, straight wall mines. Okay, that will connect properly. We have mines there. Um, do we have grid here? We have grid and mines there. So I think we just wanna continue moving across here. So we need a, we need grid here. We need path here. And we need mines down here. No, oh, I want to use you. Those will go there. Probably we don't need the radars in the middle of these. In fact, I may modify, where's this guy? Um, I'm gonna take the radar out of this one. Okay. All right, so that got, we're building this. Then we need a grid in here, uh, which I can do like 
that. We can get the path like that. Then we can get the, let's see, we need straight wall mines there and there. And we need straight wall dragon teeth there. And we need straight wall flamethrowers there. Okay. And we don't need that radar. Okay. Uh, that way we can keep that going, extending down. Uh, ooh, we finished landfilling this, which means we can finish putting the grid in. Uh, that will allow us to finish landfilling that. And this is where we want to turn this corner. So let's just get all this stuff squared away. Uh, defenses, convex corner wall mines. Like that. Uh, deep fences, convex corner wall flamethrowers. Did that show up in the right place? Nope. Go that way. Okay. And then convex corner wall dragon teeth. That way. And then this is going to be the concave guy, which we already have the mines for. So defenses, concave corner wall dragon teeth. And then concave corner wall flamethrowers. Like that. Okay, that gets us, at least gets us the wall down to there. But we are gonna have to, we are gonna have to extend this down somehow. Um, but we can worry about that later. Okay, uh, that is, that is gonna keep a lot of stuff busy, so. Uh, let's actually go load up on stuff to go outposting and train creating. So we need to go manage our inventory a little better here. So let's go back up by the mall. Okay. Uh, I guess the main things, I guess I want to work on the train stuff first. Let's get the train stuff first. And let's see, this, this is an area I do actually want to get a significant chunk of a landfill. So what, how much is this? 769. Uh, that's, that's a fair chunk. But maybe we round this off to a full thousand. Well, these are all going to get reset by when we add stuff to the mall. But that's okay. All right, I feel like I can get rid of a bunch of this stuff. Uh, let's see. I guess let's do... Uh, so I said we're going to do the train stuff first. So primarily that is signals. So we need some more chain signals. And large power poles. Do we care about lights for these? I think we don't care about lights for these yet. Uh, large power poles. Only 50. Doesn't feel like it's enough, but uh, again, those will get reset, so that's fine. Um, we are gonna need more rails. over here with the stone. Here they are. Okay, and then we are going to need armaments. Let's get 
rid of these. of this do I really want to clear out? Actually, I want to make this be the car. I want to make this be bots. I want this to be tank. Okay. Now we have a bunch of oak rails, signals, electric poles. Do we have stations? We have stations. Uh, we don't have to worry. I think I won't worry about the boxes and this stuff yet. We do have roboforts. I guess that's helpful. Uh, right, more ammo. Oh, I have another, another pistol. I'll just drop that on the ground. Uh, okay, so let's go get... Let's go make sure that we've got a bunch of ammo. Let's get, we need grenades, we need flamethrower ammo, okay, and then we need tank shells, which are here, okay, all right. That should be the main things that we need. So, uh, I think what I'm gonna do is one of two things, uh, depending on how long this takes. Uh, I am, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna do this sort of real time in the, um, on camera, I think depending on how long this takes, I'm either gonna do a sped up time-lapse video of clearing these biters out and building the rails across, or <clears throat> I'm just gonna do it and only record some, you know, maybe we'll just do a swipe and a cut scene and we'll just come back and then we'll all be done. Um, I don't think, I think the main thing that may be interesting is what are we gonna do about <clears throat> getting, uh, getting a landfill across here and so, because the landfill is gonna come, or the rails are gonna come across here. All right, good, all those guys died. Okay, so then that means that I think we also want to do, I think we want to do grid here and here. Uh, we want to do path there. And after the grid gets in here, oh, the grid is gonna be in there. So then I can do the landfill one here. Um, Cause I think we wanna landfill all of this in just to make things easier for us. Okay, so, and we're going, we want path up here. All right, how busy are the bots? Ah, there's still some bots available, okay. All right, so uh, I'm gonna leave this here for the moment and then uh, either we'll get a nice sped up video here or uh, I'll just be back and it'll be done. Um, or, you know, I'll be back if something interesting happens. So uh, stay tuned.
Okay, one of the things that was happening is the iron trains were running out of fuel. And I was like, why is that happening? And it's because the fuel line here is running in the wrong direction. So uh, we need to come reverse that business. Oh, I need belts for this. Uh, all right, let's go get some belts. Ugh. I really just need a little bit of belt. Whoops, this is a jump start. I don't need to be in here. Although if there's belts in here, I might as well grab them. some more belts. That's actually probably all the belts I need, but I might as well grab more rails as long as I'm here. Uh, where are they? Here they are. Okay, what, do we, what is this all waiting on? That's all fine. Okay, these guys, we haven't redone the stations on yet. Okay. We got some flamethrower action. That's exciting. Um, let's see. I guess in order to protect the end of this, what we should really do is get some more mines out this way. Like that. Um, because the wall is going to continue this direction. And that'll protect the flamethrowers that are on the end. Okay, let's see how that works. Uh, okay, here comes fuel. Uh, do we have trains here? We don't have trains here, so hopefully they will come back. All right, uh, back we go to the uh, either what will be a sped up video or a cutscene, so I'll see you either way in a little bit. All right, hey there. Uh, let's see, what do we have going on right now? What we have going on right now is that we we probably have enough stone over here to make all the landfill that we're looking for, but uh, we don't have enough active miners, so the throughput on the stone is very slow. 
which means that this, uh, this train takes quite a while to load up. So we have to kind of, we're gonna have to kind of wait for that a little bit in order to, because we're, we're out of stone right now. And so uh, we need to fill in the, let's see, what do I wanna do here? I guess I wanna do the same trick with these straight wall mines. And do we have the straight wall mines on this side? Yeah, okay. So we want to do that. But, uh, but we have to, we're gonna have to wait you know, there is another stone patch over here. Uh, let's see what these guys are gonna do. Looks like an expansion group, but they got taken care of. How are we doing on mines up here? Okay, still lots of mines, that's good. So we're just gonna have to wait a bit for this to come through and to finish land filling this stuff in. Although I guess we're getting some landfill out of this still. Uh, although we have this little patch here. So maybe, maybe what we'll do is we'll go tap that one uh, that feeds the jumpstart base and we can at least get some more uh, landfill made. But, uh, but we're gonna have to, like that stuff is gonna have to finish before uh, let's see, I need to make sure that my own robots come back in. Those guys are, what are those guys doing? Oh, they're putting lights down, okay. So, uh, so yeah, so let's, I'm gonna go tap that. Otherwise, uh, I'm gonna be back after we have enough landfill put in to start uh, coming, uh, finishing that, uh, that sort of transverse uh, rail bridge across that lake to connect the two sides of the base. So uh, stay tuned. I'm definitely going to cut scene that one because I, I think there's just going to be a lot of waiting around for it. Although, you know, I guess I can, I guess I can start working on rails over this side uh, as well. But uh, let's see, how many rails do I have? I still have lots of rails. So maybe I'll, maybe I will all right, we'll see. Uh, we'll, we'll go back to either sped up video or cutscene here, and we will be back. Okay, we are back. Uh, let's see, where have we gotten to? We now have the trans-based railroad. So that is exciting. We've got, uh, got it uh, coming out and around here, and we still have to figure out how to connect this all the way through here, which I have some ideas about, but uh, we've also extended the wall up here as well as our sort of temporary uh, line of mines up here. And let's see, what else has happened? Um, I did decide to go tap this stone patch, which was right outside. Uh, I did decide that I would actually take it up here to belt it in and be loaded onto the train just because that way it will plug into the train system that we already have. Uh, the other thing that I did was, since we're not doing research right now, I, I switched this splitter so that it prioritizes putting coal in to the steam engines. And since we're right around sort of our, our design peak, and so as a result, uh, we've actually drained a bunch of the coal out of here, which is good stuff. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch this back. And uh, we are going to go uh, see if we can redo this, uh, this station here. So uh, we need to get rid of the close, closest track. And then I guess we'll grab all of this. Needs to go away. And this. 
Um, and then we can paste in our lane balanced unloading station. This one. Okay, so we can have the bots go deal with that now. So that's good stuff. Uh, what do we have here? I think the other thing, I guess we have this balanced. Um, I'm still trying to drain this out here. So I feel like, well, we're just not using very much of this. So that's, that's just going to have to wait for a bit um, until we do more stuff in the mall, need to produce more stuff in the mall. Okay, so uh, I think the next thing that we need to do is, is to figure out these stations down here. And, uh, oh, I guess the other, the other thing I should mention, there was this extra stone patch over here that I also, uh, I also tapped to make uh, bricks and landfill up here in the jumpstart base, which I think that's about all it's really doing. Um, as you can see up here, flamethrowers are in effect and actually working uh, as we would expect, so that's good stuff. Um, we may have to come up here and push these guys back a little bit. We'll, we'll see if we need to do that or not. How far out is the pollution cloud going? Yeah, it's hitting those guys, so we'll have to do something about them. Uh, okay, but I guess the next thing is we gotta, we have to do something with this stuff here. So, um, my thought on this is what we should do is, since we don't have sort of extra land filly stuff to do right now, is, um, I'm gonna just cut these, uh, the inputs. Um, I'll cut this here as well. And then once all of that drains, we'll get this, we'll just park this train out of here. Um, both of these trains can probably come over here and stack. Uh, I guess this one needs this one to get out of the way. So um, once all of the stone drains out of this, and I guess I also want to do this over here for the copper. So let's just, um, get rid of those for now and this one let's see where are we gonna want to park it I guess we want to park it like here and then we'll take this station off. Okay. Um, this one, does it have fuel? I wonder. We probably have to put fuel in that stuff. Um, okay. Let's go get a bunch of fuel for those trains. And let's see, we need to go visit those. way. I need to go down here. And out to the copper patch. Um, I need an exit. Uh, where are my... I have gates out here somewhere that are big enough to drive through. I mean, the ones for the trains are kind of skinny, and I'm not that good of a driver. Here we go. Here's an exit. All right, that's nice. Okay, and these are the copper trains. So we want to try to drain as much of uh, as much of this as we can. Okay, um, you go there.
Okay, uh, let's see, let's get a little more fuel for you. A little more fuel for you. A little more fuel for you. Who's attacking us? Uh, how'd they get in there? Oh! They wandered on the rails! No way! Okay, we gotta... Wow, that's wild. Okay, I guess we're gonna go deal with those guys. No way. Okay, that was not something I expected. Um, okay, so that means that... Um, because we don't have... We don't have any defense over here. We gotta go round, round those guys up. Uh, that copper train has to load up anyway. All right, we have to think what we're gonna do about that. Uh, this guy's in the wrong place. This is all up here. This way. All right, they're all up in this corner here. There they are. Okay. Did I get them all? All right. Uh, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do for defense here? Um, I guess what we need to do is probably um, we need to extend this wall, basically, so that we can get gates over here. Um, so okay, straight wall of dragon teeth. Um, let's make a copy of this and put it here. Let's put a landfill on it. And put that there. That should put a bunch of landfill. And it'll put the gates, more importantly. Um, and then let's just get rid of this one. And then we also, I think, need to do the same thing for this guy. Make a copy. I have to make a copy or the landfill, landfilling the blueprint thing doesn't work. Okay. There. Okay. Um, I think I am going to need to put a rule report here. If I do that, they will still, I think, not connect. So that's okay. All right. So that will be our solution to that. All right, let's go see what we, what we have. Uh, let's go take a peek down here. Did this train fill up? It did. So then we want you to come park like here. And then you're gonna take that off. And then this guy is gonna start. So basically I'm trying to drain, I'm trying to drain these chests here. Um, did I finish this one? I did finish this one. Okay, so then you are actually going to go park by the stone. And then we will take this off. And then this one, this one. Um, you just need to go like here-ish and then take off the stone. 
All right, bunch of landfill is coming in, so that's good stuff. There's the gates. Um, it looks like I have to actually put this grid in. These are out of the way now. Okay, so I think um, I think the idea is we're going to continue the rails down this way. Oh, we want to see some. Oh, they just ran out of mines. Never mind. Okay, are you full? Full. Let's park you there. You go fill up. All right, I think the idea is, uh, let's see, rail system, loading station stone. I think what I figured out was that I could put this station this way and that I can put this station this way. Uh, and that if we do that, uh, I think we can fix all the rails. So, so first we gotta pick up this one. All right, so we're gonna get rid of all of this. Probably not the RoboPort. All right, let's get this. Let's clear these, let's blacklist. Um, let's leave in roboports and mines and electric poles. And maybe radar if they show up. Okay, so we will not deconstruct any of that. And so I believe we can then do this. And let's see, we're not currently connected. So I think what I want is, I do want to connect this to the RoboPort grid. How are we doing up here? Did this all landfill in? Uh, it will soon, I think. Um, did this one finish? This one finished. Okay, so that means, where's our coal train? Okay, so you're gonna go there and then you're going to go to, oh, we need to rename this thing. You're gonna be called something like that, but with coal. All right, coal. Yes. And you are going to go until coal drop off until you are empty. All right, that should help us there. We do have to plug this stuff back in. this stuff, uh, which is way easier to do. Actually, I'm not that far away from it. All right, 
it. Uh, we need to reverse this. Okay. What now? Oh, we do have guys up there. What the heck? Um, they, they want to keep coming across the land bridge. Alright, let's go save that stuff. Maybe we can drive on the land bridge. Alright, I'm going to just do this by myself. Uh, did the landfill finish? It did. So then we can... Let me get out of here before I blueprint myself in. Um, okay. So what we want is... We want straight wall dragon teeth in there like that. And then we want straight wall flamethrowers like that. Okay. That should prevent anybody else from coming in that way. Uh, what the heck is this stuff? This stuff is like in my way. Uh, let's get out of here. Okay. Alright, good. Uh, let's go back over and see what's going on. With... Maybe I don't have to go over there. Let's see. How's this looking? Let me pick all this stuff up. Those, I think, are connected. Yes. Okay. This is like the great train rearrangements here. All right, but that stuff will come in and then we'll have defenses over the water. So that's okay. I guess we're probably going to want to continue that as the base moves north. Although I don't think we need to move north until we get to nuclear power. Okay, and then what we want is... Um, no, I want rail system loading station stone. Right? Like this. Okay, then that means this stuff will come over here. We'll go there. Who's getting attacked now? All right, flamethrowers did their stuff, which is great. Um, 
let's see. I think I want then a grid out here, except for not these guys. Okay. Um, deconstruction planner. Let's undelete that stuff. And then I believe I'm going to need power for these. Those now. That's fine. And then we want straight tracks over here. Fortunately, we're like just outside the main base RoboPort networks, and so we can take advantage of extending the network out here for this type of grand rearrangements. Um, although, I think um, we need to get, I already have all the trains I want. Whoops. Eh. All right, so um, I want to get rid of all of these trains. And then we need the... Um, I guess we'll get rid of this, some of this mine stuff in here. stuff is coming down here. And in. And in. Okay. That means we can come here and we can we can deconstruct like this stuff. Paste in a T that way. So we've got a continuous route this way. things back in. Okay. Um, that should hopefully load everything up. And where's my stone trains? Did you unload everything here? station you're going to go to stone until you are full and why can't you go there oh because this hasn't we haven't finished connecting this yet that's why uh, that makes sense uh, you also want to go to stone until you are full Once those tracks rearrange, we should be in good shape. How are we doing over here on draining this stuff? Uh, not very well. Um, I suppose at the very least.
Well, so what I should do, actually what I should do is I should just cut these things. For the time being, I want to take, um, let's see, are these getting, yeah, this also gets energy, all right, let's see. So I think I want to get rid of this and this and these. And that should disconnect us from and then I should be able to defenses. Whoops. Okay, and then we gotta put our dragon teeth back in. Uh, convex corner wall, dragon teeth. That. Uh, this is a concave dragon teeth. That. Then we need the Convex uh, flamethrowers. And we need the concave flamethrowers just in case. Concave. Yeah, there was a pipe missing there. Okay, so that should restore the wall, so that's good. Um, this can't be seen because we need to get a grid out here. But not this guy, but this guy. there okay good oh we're in the middle of unloading this stuff um, you need to go there and forget that one and you should go load up on stuff Okay, those train tracks are almost back in. These are finished. So as soon as these go in, we should see our stone trains go back out. We still want to bring stuff in here. I don't know. I have to think about that one. Where are these guys? Are these guys? Let's see what's going to happen to these guys. Hopefully, they run into the mines. Yep. How many mines do you have? Plenty. Okay. All right, is this a bunch of rails coming in? Good. Are you done loading? Uh. Oh, right, you can't get in there yet. 
because you need you also need the rails to get in there. Flamethrower is to the rescue. All right. Oh, is that a stone train going out? Uh, maybe. Looks like it is. Trying to go there. Okay, that means this guy can maybe go park over here. And this one can start. How much is left in these? Some. We should really, I guess, did we, I guess we tried to lane balance all this stuff, so maybe we'll just leave that as it is. This is not, this is not lane balanced. Oh, but it's lane balanced coming out here, so I guess that's probably okay. want to like get some more copper trains just to like unload them just to unload the rest of this okay you're gonna go park there and you're not going to go there all right, how much is left in here? It's like two train loads worth. Okay, let's do this. Give me this guy. Uh, trains and train fuel, fine. Um, I'm going to make two of these. right now all right stone seems to be back working so that's good so we just need these trains to come in and then we'll we'll park the extra copper trains over here for the moment Flamethrower is working. Okay. All right, uh, train is arriving. I need to go down there with fuel. I need some more fuel. I don't think that's working the way I want it. I thought I could pick it up while I was in the car, but apparently not. All right, let's go down to those Oh, look at this. Here comes some bots trying to deliver coal. Uh, maybe it'll work if we're just patient. Of 
course, I'm not going to be patient, probably. Uh, we're going to end up with, like, a lot of extra trains here. I think that's actually okay. Um, sneak through here. here until you are full. Go. And then you also need to go there until you are full. Go. All right, let's see if that drains the rest. Unfortunately, like a ton of ore is like about the worst the worst possible sort of s amount of stuff to rearrange, just like it's so much of it. Um, but because we're actually, I think we're gonna put another copper delivery down here, maybe. Um, may have to design a four-way intersection here in order to get this guy turned around properly. Well, that's loading pretty quick. How's power? is left in these now. Uh, maybe two will do it. Let's see. Stone is working. All right, you're, you're a full. So you can actually go up here and park. And then you will not go there. that blueprint. This guy. We need one more. Okay. Uh, all right. Ooh, look at these guys. Where are you gonna go? Oh, you're gonna come on. get fried. Nice. All right. Um, are you full? Not yet. the rest of this train. Yes, and I think we established that. Oh, but I'm right nearby, aren't I? Uh, you're gonna go 
here until you are full. Okay, and you're full, so you're gonna go, let's park you there so you're not near me. Hopefully, just drain the last bits here. Are these uneven? Yeah, these are less than these. Oh no, they're all just all draining. little bits here off the belt For the last little bits here. Okay, good. You are going to go park here and then forget about that. Okay, now. I think. What we want to do is put a grid in here. Uh, we need a radar down there. Um, and we need power to these guys. Be able to pick this all up. Uh, yeah, once the once this radar comes in, we should be able to see over here. to pick this up and rearrange it. I'm going to have to get some of this stuff out of the way. We can see. Okay, so I think we need to continue this direction. Let's see. First, we need to pick up all of this. Wait, where was that thing that. Okay, what did I do here? Blacklist. We want to leave in uh, Roboports, big electric poles. Radars. Is that it? I feel like there was one more thing we left in. Um, what? 
was it? Maybe that's enough to leave in. It's probably enough to leave in. Okay. So then uh, we can grab all of this. And here. We just pick all of that back up. Um, and then we're going to pick up this stuff to here, this as well, this as well. T-junction this way. Um, ah, we're hitting... Okay, we need to get rid of like these mines here. And then we can put the T-junction back in. continue south here but we need a branch so I think in order to do that we're going to have to design a t-junction um, which I think I will just do I think I may do that off camera but in the meantime we can put in the uh, loading station copper I think it needs to point this way. Uh, oh, I guess if we're going to do a four-way junction, it could actually stay where we had it. Yeah. Okay. F fine. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. We're going to let that run. I think we're going to call this the end of an episode. We need a four-way intersection. I'll do that off camera. And uh, at the start of the next episode, we'll put that in. And then I think we can grab uh, these copper outposts and they will connect down here to another copper drop off. And that's what we will do next. So uh, that's what we have for today. So as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. And until then, bye.